Now, if you guys need coins to pick up a player for your team, check out Mud Store. Use promo code TOKE for 10% off. Bro, it literally just dawned on me how expensive power-ups are. Like, literally, my mind is... I don't know if it's just me, but the, I, I don't know what made me just think about that, but I, 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 you will see in this video. Now, I am going to actually be dabbling myself into the Team of the Week program, man. I haven't really had any interest in the Team of the Week program at all this year, and you guys will probably see why in today's video. But Am Cam Scram Newton has caught my attention, boys. It's time to bring in a brand new quarterback, and I think... Right now, Cam Newton is that guy. For our Team of the Week 7 Elite Fantasy Packs, EA Sports, let us open these with coins, bro. 1,000 points, yeah, I all know. It's not happening. I'm not opening those, not spending money on those packs. I'm gonna open up these 10 that we can actually buy with coins, and we'll see if we can get anywhere near getting close to Cam Newton. I don't know. Loki, I've opened a lot of these packs and they're just, Exactly like that. I'm not I'm not trying to be negative guys, but I do remember when team of the week used to be the best promo Every single week, so we're gonna do these. We're gonna see how close we can get I want to bring in Cam Newton, but I also want to try to pull potentially One of the expensive cards my right, team of the week back number three week seven back dude Honestly, I think I forgot to do one week worth of solos. So um I don't know if we're gonna get an option, but I, uh, I I pretty much screwed myself on the solos. Now the other thing I just mentioned at the beginning of the video about the power-ups, bro. Oh, we got an elite though. 82 Tyrell Williams. He's been killing it. Two elites, one back. Never mind. Now Cam Newton doesn't always have the best deep ball, but he's fast. He can truck. He can scramble. He can throw. We are definitely gonna be using Cam. 81. Marlon Mack right there and a 78. All right, next team of the week seven back, 79 overall and another 81. There we go, 78 overall, 79 overall. All we gotta do is get one of the high overall team of the week player. I think like an 85 or an 84 overall would be the one that we're looking for, the most expensive one. Dude, I gotta start calling my stuff before it happens. 85, carry on Johnson, man. 89 speed, 89 excel, 86 carrying, which is really, really good. 65 catching, good elusive, eh, 68 elusive. He's still probably going to play good. Got one of the best ones we needed. I don't know how much he's going to be selling for, but I'm assuming it's definitely going to help us out a little bit. 78 overall, Michael Roberts, Benjamin Watson, and that is going to be the final team of the week card that we can pull with coins. Now, obviously, you can spend about $250 and open all the rest of these packs, but <laughs> not me. After opening up all those packs, we still need a Phillip Rivers 86 overall, DJ Swearinger, Julius Peppers 85 overall, Trey Waynes, and Kyle Von Noy. In order to get an 85 or 86 overall player, you need to add 282s to 281s. I remember where it used to be, add all the gold cards for a chance at any elite. So you could do the gold cards, you could get an 81, or you could get the 85 all in one set. But now it's kind of broken down to 85, 86, 81 to 84. Mm, I don't know about that. To do this set from scratch is 60,000 coins right now, 25 minutes after launch. Now, Philip Rivers is 77,000 coins. Even if you pull the best card after tax, you're really only making about seven to 8,000 coins. And that's right after the promo comes out right there, 85. Of course, we got the one we already have. We only need to buy one more card to be able to do this set one more time with hopes that we can get potentially Philip Rivers or DJ Swearinger, Julius Peppers, to help us out on the set. Now, that's not only to get Cam Newton. We have to do that set to get James White and another player to potentially get Cam Newton if we want to add those cards into the set. So we're going to add this right here. See which one of the 85 to 86. It's just a lot. It's a lot of sets, bro. 86, DJ Swearinger. All right, Philip Rivers has been bought, and we are officially going to finish James White, who actually looks like... I believe a really good running back. The problem is, if I want to use James White and Cam Newton, I got to buy Cam Newton and I got to rebuy James White. One of the two, but we're going to finish this 91 overall. James White right here, 91 overall. He's a halfback for the New England Patriots. 89 speed, 92 excel, uh, 91 elusiveness. Trucking is a very good 89 carrying, 77 catching. Really, really nice. And with Michelle down, 
probably going to be the featured running back in the Patriots offense. 400,000 coins for Whitney Merciless. Probably will go down, dude. 81 speed, 91 tackle, 87 block shedding. But I want Cam Newton for some gameplay later tonight. So I'm scooping them up, baby. 400,000 coins spent. And we are basically, we've already spent a good million coins. Basically a million coins to get Cam Newton. I think he's only worth 800,000 coins. Week 7, Cam Newton, guys. 93 overall. Now, I wish this was it. I honestly, I wish this was it. 83 speed, 94 throw power, 88 short, 84 middle, 82 deep, 90 throw on the run. That 83 speed is going to be nice, and I bet he's got some pretty good trucking. He's got 85 agility, 86 jumping, 81 elusiveness with 80 trucking, and 92 ball carry vision, 85 juke, 84 spin. The problem is is now if I want to power him up, bro. Let's get let's get going on this journey. Now I'm also going to be doing another power up team of the week player, a highly requested player, Melvin Gordon, team of the week from last week. Now I've already bought his card and I'm going to power him up as well. Honestly, Loki, dude, 91 speed, 90 excel without the power up is really really nice. But in order to power up this card, as you guys all know, I've got to buy the diamond version, 200,000 coins. Now this is going to be a lot worse for Cam Newton. It had me thinking, man, like power-ups and chemistries and abilities is wild for some plus ones, but I'm going to do it anyway. 28,000 for Melvin Gordon. If there's anyone that's good at math, if you guys want to calculate exactly how much training and coins I spent on Melvin Gordon, you saw the price for Melvin Gordon and also Cam Newton and leave a comment down below with both prices, total power-up and training. I will pin that comment for people to see. Now the market is geared towards Cam Newton right now because he's a brand new player that came out 6,000 coins for the power up. 3,000 coins for the 84 overall Cam Newton. And just over 300,000 coins for the Gatorade version 90 overall. Now, I could probably potentially use a power up pass for him, but I think I got my power up pass with someone else. So it is what it is. I also have to buy some of these flashback players, guys, to quick sell to get training points to actually add the abilities on them after I've already bought the other cards. This is wild. Really, oh, I really, really hope this is going to be enough training to fully max out our guy after having to buy all the other cards. But if it's not, we'll have to go buy some more flashbacks. But ultimately, dude, this Melvin Gordon, I already peeped what the power-up looks like. And it, it's going to be a very good card. So I'm going to try to run the football. Obviously, I don't know what the gameplay before this is going to be like. But I'm sure you guys have seen it before. We're going to go Melvin Gordon power up right here. Oh, I did have a power up pass. So I'll use that on Cam Newton and then sell the Cam Newton one that we had. And we'll make 40,000 coins back that way. But you can see the training is eventually going to start disappearing on us really, really quick once we get up to these higher levels. One of the main reasons I wanted to do this was I have tier two sprinters. So uh, at Melvin Gordon is actually going to have 94 speed with 92 acceleration. 73 catching isn't bad. We'll go ahead and scheme them up. You basically, you need 15 team of the week players for tier six, which would be plus one speed and all the up. Dude, that's a lot of players. Now we only need to do tier one sprinter because everything else is maxed out. We're going to add sprinter to him and then his ability, never stumble, energizer, return man, a juke man specialist, spin move specialist, and stiff arm. I think I'm going to try spin move specialist. I don't know if we're maxed out on spin. I'm gonna just I'm gonna put spin move on there. All right, so now on to Cam Newton. I feel like we started the video with over eight million coins, and we're already down to six million. Definitely a lot of coins for two players. I have to go back and rewatch, but I think definitely we spent a lot. Um, the packs were all right. The problem is like James White would have been nice to get him back, but this isn't like a ranting video or anything, guys. I'm just kind of giving you, just letting you know my opinion on on everything right here. Cam Newton once again tier two sprinter go deep like i think honestly once we put him in the lineup he's gonna look really really good as far as all the boosts that he's gonna get he might be my starting quarterback for a while maybe i'll look into getting team of the week chemistry but i'm not 100 sure so we're gonna add sprinter to him which i already had sprinter so i should be able to add it for free but i don't think i can identifier conductor i'm all about the gunslinger man i'm gonna go in with gunslinger you own this chemistry. Do you want to equip it? But didn't I already have a Cam Newton back in the day that had Gunslinger? And I swear I had Cam Newton back in the day. I know I had Cam Newton back in the day. And I had to do it. 
whatever. Now, I think the move right now, guys, you can see go deep chemistry is 46 out of 30. I potentially could do exactly what I did on defense and run two chemistries on offense. Let me know which one. Obviously, I want to make it like a running chemistry. Is it going to be zone run? Let me know what I should do, and I will mess with the lineup to make that happen for you guys. Well, first, we'll go ahead and show you the guy that you just watched gameplay, and if you missed that, go and watch the gameplay with Melvin Gordon, and I will have Cam Newton gameplay coming out. 90, wow. 94 speed, 92 excel, 93 agility, 95 carrying, 73 catching, 92 elusiveness, 89 break tackle. We did put spin move on him, so let's see what his spin is. That 892 excel, dude. This card, Loki, is really nice. 93 spin move. He's gonna be a beast, dude. Card for later tonight, brand new 95 overall. Cam Newton powered up. 86 speed, 98 throw power with gunslinger. 89 short, 86 middle, 87 deep, 94 throw on the run. Let me know what you guys think about Cam Newton. Obviously, he's got the trucking stats as well. 86 speed is definitely, definitely nice. As always, if you enjoyed this video and my opinions on Team of the Week, they got to fix it, bro. They got to figure out something to fix Team of the Week because right now it's 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 literally an L, but uh, I did participate in this week. Cam Newton, he got me, and they got me for 2 million coins and a bunch of training. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you.